Hey, what's up guys, Austin here, and yes, I know, I am back with another recorded tutorial. I did not know when I was going to be back with any recorded content, but I'm back, alright guys? I had someone in my one of my comment sections saying, hey, I'm waiting for your latest video to come out, and stuff like that. So, I'm back, guys, I'm back, for now at least. I'm going to be doing probably live streams more, but today we're going to be installing ScriptHook V version 2699.0, the newest version, just came out 27th of July. I'll uh, see so yeah, you guys. I hope you guys do enjoy this tutorial. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe down below to post notifications turned on. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. Alright, guys, so you want to click on the first link down below in the description. It's going to bring you to this page right here. What you guys are going to want to do is not click on download SDK because that's for developers. Click on the download right here. Alright, guys, click on the download. Click on script hook if it's released. Click on script hook V. Alright guys, so it's going to bring you to this page right here, alright guys, so you're going to want to download right here, and do not download the SDK, it's for developers, download this one right here, alright, so click on download. Uh, it's going to say it might be dangerous, but watch when I send it guys, watch when I send it. Boom, security checks are done, it's it, it's always been safe guys, alright, so if you guys get scared of downloading this, don't get scared, alright, it's completely safe, 100% trusted. So now what you guys are going to want to do, you can close out of that and go to your main GTA 5 directory, in this case mine's going to be the D drive, times 86, Epic Games, GTA V. Alright guys, this is going to be mine. You're going to want to click on the bin right here. Now, what you guys are going to want to do is you do not need the native trainer.asi. All you need is a dimput8.dll and scripthook.v.dll. Now, I have the older version of scripthook in my game because I did not update my uh, my game yet. I'm still on a reverted version uh, because it runs perfectly fine in the reverted version. So, I decided not to update it. So, I'm going to take out the scripthookv. So, I'm going to go ahead and take out the scripthookv.dll and the dimput8.dll uh, right here. So I can put the back of my game after this tutorial because they're the older version. So what you guys are going to want to do is hold the control key and highlight the dimput 8 and scripthookv.dll. Alright guys, after you guys do that, make sure you have a little white space right here. You're going to want to drag it and drop it just like that, alright guys. Now it's going to say for me to replace the files, I'm just going to replace the files. For you guys, it might say the same thing. If it does not, then that means you, you've never installed it before. So yeah guys, that is how you install ScriptCook V version 2699.0. So hope you guys did enjoy this tutorial. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe down below with your post notifications turned on. And I'll see you guys in the next video slash live stream. Peace out.